back. Today we're back out at Cannesville. We're going to do some last minute pre-fishing. Uh, the wind's really uh, picking up and it's been windy the last few times I've been here. So uh, we're just going to try to find a pattern, try a few, a few things, um, measure our best five and see, get an idea of you know what it's looking like. Uh, stick around to the end and I'll talk a little bit about what patterns that I plan to use for the tournament. Um, and what lures are working for me. Um, just do a little recap. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. There we go. Same one. Decent one. Let's see what he measures. Seventeen and three quarters.
difficult.
All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and call it a day. As you can see, it's pretty windy out. Um, didn't find much of a pattern, but there's a lot of fish in this lake. I plan to throw a lot of lipless cranks up around the hydrilla that's not topped out. And uh, I've caught plenty of fish doing that. I plan to probably throw a chatterbait and a swim jig. Also had some luck with a, a white fluke, so I'll be throwing a fluke around if it's not too windy. And uh, hopefully early morning, I plan to throw a, a skitter walk type lure up around the edges of the hydrilla mats. And, uh, I'm hoping maybe we can get a one or two big ones. That's that's the plan anyways. I wanted to try to find a flipping bite in the hydrilla, but it's just so windy. Uh, it's going to be hard for uh, many people to, to find that bite, but that's the plan for the tournament. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll catch up with you guys on the next